We're currently in Midtown Manhattan, but this is not a New York City vlog. Because we're about to ride up to Albany and back on the historic 20th century limit. We're Stephen and Anne, caffeinated travelers of the U.S. and beyond. We're on a mission to see all 50 states. And state number 21, New York, takes us to the heart of Manhattan. We'll be boarding an historic train to ride from New York City to, well, New York City. So we just got ourselves a coffee and we tried to go into the waiting area to have a seat. You have to show your tickets to get in. So I pulled our tickets out and uh, the guy here just looked a little confused. Turns out this is not an Amtrak ticket. It's a private car ticket and we get to go up to the first class lounge. It's fancy. You feel like a VIP? I One of the many perks of VIP lounge access is free snacks and beverages. Thank you so much. Is that butter? Yes. Uh, thank you, I appreciate it. Have a good one. Your toasted bagel with butter, sir. And I got a pan au chocolat. This place is very nice. You get your choice of snacks, the complimentary, the coffee, even a cold brew. They've got infused water, and then all the different flavorings you can put it into like an iced tea, or I guess even a water if you wanted to. I just guess that you'd want the everything and not the plain bagel. Yeah, for sure. Good call, thank you. I know my guy. It's a good bagel. It's New York. Lunch. lunch was really great. We had a roasted vegetable sandwich, and the hot tip of the day are these house-made chips with grated Parmesan on it. They're phenomenal. I wonder what they're eating in the other car. <laughs> yeah, much fancier. For you know, for another couple of hundred bucks, we could have had a four-course meal and wine and beer. But you know, we thought we'd be good enough for this, and it was actually really good. So I want to see if the bathrooms are authentic mid-century style. So let's do a Mike Downey style bathroom tour, shall we? Oh yeah, look at that! Good old sink, mirror. And there I am. Frosted glass windows. Oh, look at this old school toilet. How funny is that? So our plan to watch the train turn around here in Albany didn't quite work out. Turns out it's not that exciting a process. They just kind of drive about a mile away from the station, back into a bridge, and then pull forward back into the station again. And there's really no place to watch it from, and of course we couldn't stay on the train during the process. So we decided to get a coffee here in Albany at the train station instead. I actually got her an iced tea. So we're here at the station at Grind and Brew Rendezvous, and we'd like to give a shout out to our friend Pete Puma for sponsoring this round of coffee and iced tea <laughs> from our Buy Me A Coffee page. Thanks, Pete. AKA Nick. That's right. <laughs> we know who you are. <laughs> They 
Let's put the red carpet back down, which means we can embark again. So while we wait for everyone to board for our return trip back to New York City, this is a good time to let you all know that we are trying to see all 50 states. We've already made it to 18 states since we started this channel, including Alaska. Now we're giving ourselves the goal of getting to the remaining states, plus DC and Puerto Rico. And we also plan to visit five of the states that we've already been to because there's more that we want to see at each of them. And of course, we're going back to California because you know that's our favorite. So I hope y'all will tune in, watch the rest of our vlogs, watch us as we make some progress going around the United States. And if you want to follow our journey, we're going to be adding a page to our website that you can go to. I will link to it below and we will have each of the states that we've already visited marked off and list the ones that we still have yet to go to. And if you have any suggestions for us, we're going to need some help because we've done some research. We know some things we want to see in some of these locations, but some of them we have no idea what to do yet. Where's the best place to go? What's like the locals hidden secret? We would love to know something quirky, something unusual, a cool experience, a really unique place to stay. Anything along those lines would be so great to find out about. So please do visit that page. Leave a comment on that page if you have a suggestion for us or find us on Instagram and DM us there. We're always up to chat on Instagram. And we'll be seeing you on our journey to the remaining states at DC and Puerto Rico. All right, here we go. We're heading back. Oh, isn't it so nice after driving these past few days to be able to just sit back, check out all these views? It's so much more relaxing, isn't it? Chilling. The train's platform in Grand Central is a place to see and be seen. Any passerby can see household names and celebrities boarding the train on their way to Chicago. Part of the new design included the addition of a football field length red carpet upon which passengers would walk to their accommodations in stock. This was done only in New York and never for any other train. In the years following, whether anyone realized it or not, this ritual became a part of Hollywood and star studded events long past the days of the 20th century limited. So, yes, the red carpet was invented thanks to the train that you were riding right now. How cool is that? I never even thought about where the whole red carpet thing started. Gosh knows we've seen enough of them back home. And to know that we are now on the train that started that whole tradition, I guess, of VIP and celebrity event red carpets is really cool. So our ticket cost $150 each, and that got us seats in the tavern car with a buffet. Now we get to check out the Hickory Creek car. Those tickets were $350 each. They got a four course meal with beer and wine. Here's 1948. We won the war. Every American railroad is flush with cash right now. So what do you spend it on? You spend it on passenger cars. Okay, look, they even had pockets for your cell phone back in the day. <laughs> but is there a charger? By the way, did you notice that on that poster we were looking at, every single person that worked on the train that was helping passengers? was a person of color. No way. Yeah. Even just a photo of their hands, like giving someone a towel, you could tell. No way. Yeah. 1948. Well, you guys, this has been an amazing day. We have learned so much cool history. I really hope that if you haven't subscribed already, you will hit that button below and make sure you join us for the rest of our adventures around the United States. We've still got more than 30 states to go, plus Washington, D.C. and Puerto Rico. And if you haven't seen them all yet, you can catch up and go back and see our trips to places like Mississippi, Alabama, Alaska, Seattle, Washington, Vegas, and so many more. So do catch up and then join us on the rest as we go around the United States. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Places, but then there are some states we really need to research. Oh yeah, ready for we some dessert. Oh no. All right, I don't think I'm in the frame. I'll just wait here for a second. Just look casual. Get into these. Hang on, is that chocolate chip or raisin? 
Oh man, I hope I got chocolate chip. Oh well, I'll give them to Andy. How long is she gonna talk for? No, no, wait, dude, she. Oh, man. okay, that's all good. Hey, all right, thank you. Hey, nice watch. <laughs>